Hi grade one artists, today we're going to learn about a new abstract painter. Her name is Sonia Delani. She's from the Ukraine and she makes artworks with lots of circles. So as you can see in this example, many of her circles are very colorful, different sizes, some overlap or intersect, and there's lots of different lines going through them as well. You can see some crosses and X's. We're going to create our own Sonia Delani inspired artwork. So put your name, class, and inspired by Sonia Delani. Then you're going to draw one line across your big space and one line across your small space. Then we're going to take some circle tracers and you can feel free to trace these circles wherever you like. They can go on top of the line. The circles can stop when they get to one circle so that they don't overlap. Some of them might overlap you could trace half a circle instead of the full circle. Don't forget to do many different sizes and make some concentric circles. That means some circles that are inside of each other. If you need a circle that's a different size, you can always hand draw your circle if you can't find a tracer. Make sure you make some uh, going off the page as well. And don't forget your small artwork. It's not gonna take as many circles to fill it up, but make sure you make many different circles intersecting and overlapping. Then you're ready to paint with watercolors. Notice Miss Kasky here is using one color at a time. She's using all the orange or all the purple she needs before moving on to another color. Don't forget to paint the background as well. We want this to be really colorful. If the colors mix together a little bit, don't worry because after they dry, the next step is to take a permanent marker and trace all of your circles so that they pop out and stand out really well again. In the end, you'll end up with something like this. All right, artists, go forth and be brilliant. Have fun.